is something unusual that's been happening in East Boston. These big shipping containers have been popping up in one neighborhood, but it's what's inside that's really getting people talking. They are reusing old shipping containers to grow a new business idea there, and it's starting to sprout up all over the city. Sitting in the middle of a tow yard in East Boston is something you can barely even notice, but this large green container has people excited. I think it's awesome. It's good for the community. Nestled among the trucks is Sean Cooney's new business. I sold a software company in 2013 and was looking for the next thing to do. And what he's doing is really growing on him. We take uh, a bunch of seeds and we plant them down at the bottom. This in, is Cornerstock, a fully functioning farm plugs. in an old shipping container in the middle of the city. Most people can't even get their head around it until they actually walk in the door. Even if they kind of understand it, until they walk in and see it for themselves, they, they, they still really don't quite understand how, how big it is. Here, he's growing basil, lots of it, and selling it to a produce wholesaler in Haymarket. Most surprising is how much product they can get out of this one container. Each time, they can get 6,000 plants. That's about an acre of basil for just this one small space. But then you slide it into the system, put it on the hook, and the irrigation system is actually integrated inside of the, uh, the mounting rack. This is the brainchild of Brad McNamara. He and a friend started Freight Farm. It is essentially a farm in a box. You get the whole box. It comes complete with everything you need ready to grow. It's unloaded from the truck. You plug it in, you add water, and you're essentially ready to get started. Here you plant the seed, move them to the vertical towers, and the plants grow thanks to the specially designed lighting, air, and watering system. And the key really is that idea of plant density, plant efficiency, you know, the efficient use of light, water, and space all together. We just trim them. Throw them. From basil to peppers, lettuce and kale, all thriving in this tight space. The future for city farmers or anyone looking to get fresh local produce off the farm. It's a great business and a great time to be in this, this business right now. Cost seventy thousand dollars to buy one freight farm. So far, sixteen have been sold. Eight are in Boston, including one on the campus of Boston Latin in the heart of the Longwood Medical Facility. The best part about it is shipping containers are available all over the world, sitting empty. So it's a great reuse idea and a recycle idea as well. Wow! And imagine with our weather, you can control right. it very well. And you decide when it's daylight. You decide when it's nighttime, cool. and you can control how the plants grow. And they're actually getting lots of produce from it. Some so smart people out there. Very <laughs> smart.